everyone. I am Janine Davis of James Davis and Associates. I believe everyone can succeed and be happy with the right encouragement, inspiration, and motivation. I'm here to provide some of that with today's confidence tip of the day. Today's tip, don't be afraid to start over, even if you're starting from scratch, because you're starting with experience. Think about it. When you start over again, it's not like you first coming into the world and you've never done anything before. When you're starting over, you are starting with the experience of everything that came before. That should boost your confidence. Think about it. When you learn to walk, you didn't just get up and start walking across a room. Most likely you took a few steps, you fell, you took a few steps, you fell. But you didn't quit, you kept trying and now you can walk. When Thomas Edison invited the light, excuse me, invented the light bulb, he tried over and over and over again. He tried 99 ways and failed to create the light bulb. He didn't quit. What he said is, hey, I now know 99 ways how not to make the incandescent light bulb. He went on ahead and did it and invented the light bulb. That's you. Start over again with the knowledge that you now have experienced. All of the times that you start over, even if you start over and over and over and over, it's okay. Let that boost your confidence because that proves to you that you have endurance. You can make it to the end. You, when you're starting all over, think about it. You get up, it's a new day, it's a new year, it's a new school semester new relationship, new job, whatever it is when it's new, do you notice that you have this enthusiasm? You have an excitement. It's a new chance for you. You have new energy. And so when you're starting over, you're bringing that new enthusiasm, that new excitement, that new energy to whatever it is that you're doing. So boost your confidence by knowing that, yes, you're starting over, but it's not from scratch. You're starting with experience, all the things you've learned before all the ways you've learned to do things better. Don't worry about it. Keep trying. I always say that old dogs can learn new tricks. So even if you're 55, 35, 15, no matter how old you are, you can always learn something new. That should boost your confidence, the knowledge that you can learn something new, that you can do better, that you can be better. Yes, you were a horrible wife yesterday. Yes, you were a terrible employee yesterday, but today you're starting anew. You're starting fresh and you're starting with experience because now you know what you did and you know ways that you can try to do it differently, better, or a whole new thing that you've never tried before. Even if that's the case, you're bringing your old experience to it. I mean, think about how we communicate. Way back a long time ago, we had telegrams. Then we had snail mail. Then we had email, faxes. Now we're doing everything with text and video. We're always learning new ways to do things. And we're not throwing out those old things, but those are experiences that teaches you how to do better in the future. So yes, now you learn. Maybe I shouldn't scream and holler at my boss and tell her she's a crazy idiot if I don't want to get fired. You learn from those past experiences. You bring them with you to the new thing that you're trying. So yes, start again. Start something new. You're bringing experience with you. And that should boost your confidence. Even if everything you did in the past was a failure. So what? When you're starting this new thing, you're starting with that knowledge. You're starting with the experience of, I know how not to do it. So let me do something totally new and different. Time brings new value. Time brings advances. And so use those advances, boost your confidence with the knowledge of, I knew, I didn't know how to do it in the past. So I know how not to do it. And I can bring that knowledge to this new thing that I'm attempting. You are in charge of your life. You set your destiny. So if you decide you're going to be new, exciting, and you're going to do this great new thing, you can do it. Step up, stand forward, and do the new thing. Never think that you have to keep holding on to a mistake just because it took you a long time to make it. Instead, realize I can start something new. I can do this new, big, bold, audacious thing because I learned so many things in the past. I did things wrong. I did things right. And I bring all that knowledge with me to a new thing. That's the great thing about knowledge. Once you have it, no one can take it away from you and you can't trash it. So 
I'm encouraging you today. If there's a new thing you want to do, do it. Even if you've never done it before, even if you failed at it 55 times yesterday, so what? Try it again today because you're bringing all that experience with you. Now, if you need more tips, tricks, and ideas on how to boost your confidence, head on over to janinesworld.com. I've got great resources to help you boost your confidence. And I'll see you next time, everyone, with another confidence tip of the day. Bye, everybody.